Hello all, my name is Pritom and you are watching Tech with Pri. Welcome to my channel and I'm back with another tech video. Hey everyone, if you are new in this channel, so this is my channel Tech with Pri and I post tech videos in every Monday and Thursday. Okay, so if you haven't subscribed the channel, just go ahead and click the subscribe button and also hit the bell icon so that you can get notified whenever I post a new video. All right. So before starting the video guys, so if you are interested to buy the equipment that I use, so you can go ahead and check it out. So I have also posted the link here. So this is the mic I use from Boya and this is the tripod from Proton. Okay, so the link is there in the description. You can go ahead and check it out. All right. So in my last video, we have understood the concept of VPN or the virtual private network. Okay, so I have shown you how VPN works and like uh, what are the difference between the paid vpn and the free vpn and that was very interesting and also i've shown you some example of free vpn and the paid vpn that you can use all right so guys if you miss that important video you can just go ahead and click the link that is there in the description also you can find the link right now here okay so let's see what we are going to learn today Okay, so our hot topic is proxy versus VPN. Okay, so guys, already we have understood about the proxy server and the VPN server. So now let's understand the difference between them. Okay, and if you have any confusion regarding proxy and VPN, you can just go ahead and check my video. Okay, so we have the battle between proxy and VPN. We'll see differences based on number one, support level, two, security, three, speed. And finally, the pricing. So we'll see how both proxy and VPN are different based on this uh, point. And finally, I'll show you the place in your Windows 10 laptop where you can go ahead and configure the VPN or the proxy. Sounds good. So let's get started. So before going into the battle between proxy and VPN, let's quickly see how they work with the same purpose, okay, to secure your data to uh, hide uh, from the ISP and the uh, government. So uh, very simply with a diagram, we can see we have a mobile here and we have a PC or laptop and uh, we will connect with the VPN either or the proxy server and they will change the IP address and the location before reaching out to the, uh, the particular service that we are looking for, maybe for a web page, okay? So the main job of proxy and VPN is to hide your original details like your public IP address, like your location to the server and the server will see the IP address and the location of this VPN or the proxy server, okay? So the purpose of both proxy and VPN are same, but the techniques are totally different and based on different level. So some provides high security, some provides less, some provide much better speed, some provide less speed. So let's quickly see the differences between proxy and VPN. So let's start the battle. Okay, so first point is support level. So let's see based on the support level how VPN and proxy works differently. So for VPN, we have to install the VPN client. As you know, as you have understood from my last video that we need to install the VPN client to use the VPN server and it is a client server technology. So I'm not going uh, into the detail. Uh, so if you want to know more, you can watch my previous video. So we are installing the VPN client in our laptop or in our mobile. And then suppose we are accessing Facebook or Netflix or Chrome or any other application in our mobile or laptop. All the requests will go to the VPN server and from VPN server, it will reach out to the particular destination. For an example, after connecting to the VPN, if you are trying to access, suppose, Facebook, so the request will go to the VPN server first as in the encrypted mode, and then it will go to the Facebook server and the data will again come back to you, um, to your system. So whichever application you use after connecting to the VPN, all will go into the tunnel and then it will go to the VPN server first, then it will come back to you. So this is the support level for the VPN, okay? It kind of works in the operating system level. For proxy server, again, suppose in our laptop or phone, we have this application and uh, only the proxy server is installed in the Chrome, 
okay in the chrome extension maybe like i have shown you uh, already in my proxy server video how you can configure the free uh, proxy server client in your chrome browser so you can uh, watch it out but the main thing is for proxy server it can be applied at a single application level so if http or the hypertext transfer protocol that is using for proxy for web proxy so it will connect to the proxy server and then again it will do the like it will change your ip and location and do the rest of the thing but in the same time if you use facebook netflix or any other application they won't have the proxy server facility so at the single level you have to apply the proxy server so for using proxy in the facebook so you have to change some settings and or maybe you have to download some uh, external software for that so for vpn all you need to do is to just connect your vpn client to the server then whatever application you use it will all go to the secure tunnel to the vpn server right so for proxy we have to use the separate proxy settings for the separate application next in the security level that's very important right so for vpn uh, as we know if we search for the example.com or any website it will go to the vpn server first and then in between the data will be encrypted that is the most useful thing in the vpn server the data here after you search the example.com and make sure you connect to the vpn first and then uh, you're searching for this website and then the data is totally encrypted the way to the vpn server okay so it is going to a tunnel encrypted tunnel then it is connecting to the web server where the example.com web page is there and uh, also it is hiding the ip address and location but for proxy we search for the example.com again and it is going to the proxy server then it is going to the web server and uh, the ip address and the location has got changed but the data is not encrypted so there is a chance where hacker can hack your data from this place because the data is not encrypted like vpn so guys as you can understand vpn is more secure than proxy so i just want to let you know guys that even in the vpn server also you can't expect the 100 percent security okay so that is not possible to any any like whether you are using paid vpn or the free vpn so you can't expect 100 percent okay that's not possible even for the antivirus also you can't uh, expect like 100 percent protection right so i hope you understand so the next point is speed so again we are trying to connect to the example.com by the vpn server that is encrypted and the speed is less here so when you are searching for the example.com suppose the server of the example.com is in the india india location maybe in the bangalore and your vpn server is you are connected in the us to access the us site so what will happen is that so first your request will go to the vpn server in the us and then it will understand okay i have to go back to the bangalore to access the example.com because the server was there so it will go back to the bangalore to have access the web server of example.com so that is the same case for both proxy and vpn even in case of proxy also the proxy server can be located in different location right but in vpn it is also doing encryption of your data it is encrypting your data and that is the reason so as you can understand the service will be slow right but uh, for many paid vpn like the nord vpn the express vpn they provide much more high speed uh, than the other free vpn or the other vpn okay so you can go ahead and try it out i have already explained those things in my previous video you can watch and uh, for the proxy as you can understand the data is not encrypted so this is less secure but the speed is high because uh, they are not doing the encryption job i think it's very easy so finally we have the pricing section and uh, the proxy servers are generally free most of the proxy server and i have already shown you how you can uh, download the free proxy server also there are paid proxy server that you can use for better service most vpn services are paid okay as i mentioned they are encrypting your data and also changing your ip and location so they are providing more security as you know and there are also free vpn service that are available so that you can use it right 
so guys this is the difference between the proxy and the vpn okay this is the battle and as you can understand at the end of the day vpn is the winner because vpn is more secure vpn is encrypting your data vpn is also supporting in higher level and the price is high but uh, you are getting more security right so that is the battle between the proxy and the vpn now i'm going to quickly show you how you can uh, like change the proxy server and vpn server settings in your windows 10 so just search for the proxy and it will open the proxy settings guys as you can see under the settings tab so here you can configure manually proxy setup so this, this is something i tried uh, from the uh, internet so i found a proxy server free and i tried their address here and the port 8080 so all you need to do is just turn on the proxy server and save the settings okay and then you can access anything like it will transfer to the proxy server first this is for proxy server and we have also vpn guys so by vpn you can add a vpn connection so you have to provide the vpn provider connection name server name address so if you have configured vpn server or if you have like in your office vpn server so you can connect uh, from your own system okay but you have to uh, so you have to use the uh, like you know the username password so guys that is it for today i hope you understand the concept of the vpn and the proxy server in a better way so already individual videos are there for proxy and vpn so this is the battle video so i hope you enjoyed this video guys so if you like the video hit the like button if you have any question go to the comment section and please share this video with your friends and families so that it can reach out to many people stay safe we'll see you in the next video bye bye